Imagine that you're in a Microsoft Teams meeting and you want to share an Excel spreadsheet so that you can collaborate on it in real time. Well, that's a feature coming to Microsoft Teams really soon, but I'm going to show it to you today. The ability to share an Excel spreadsheet in a Microsoft Teams meeting and then collaborate on it in real time is something that I think is going to be incredibly useful for all sorts of people. Now, the reason I'm able to show you this feature today is because if you look at the icon in Teams here, you'll notice I have a little P up in the corner here. And if I go to the ellipse, you'll notice that in the About section, I'm currently running the public preview of Microsoft Teams. Now, uh, at the end of the video, I'll show you how you two can get the public preview. And if you're an administrator of the Teams environment, how you need to enable it for individuals in your organization. But for now, what I'm going to do is show you how I can share and collaborate on an Excel spreadsheet. So here I am. My name is Frank and this is Bender. We're having a meeting together. And maybe Bender has a problem. Maybe Bender has an Excel spreadsheet. It's full of data and he needs to do some sort of data analysis with that spreadsheet. Or maybe he needs to work on a formula and he knows that I love Excel and he wants me to help him with it. So I'm going to go to Bender's computer and he's going to share an Excel spreadsheet with me. So here I am on Bender's computer and he's going to hit the share button. And now you'll notice that there'll be a section here called Excel Live. It's in preview, like I stated. And you'll notice that there's a spreadsheet that we've been working on previously. He can browse or upload from his computer, but he's going to choose that file that we were working on previously and he's going to share it out. You'll notice there's a warning that it's going to be shared with people in the meeting. So once he shares it out, it's going to appear on my screen. We are, it's on both of our screens actually. Now the neat thing here is you will notice a couple of little changes here. First of all, if I go here and I go up to the cell here, you'll notice there's a little BR. This means that right now Bender's, uh, is, Bender's Excel spreadsheet is focused on this cell. This is the cell that he's currently in. So if I go up to cell here, AA2, and I type something in here like, you know, formula or whatever, or follow along. I'm just putting text in here, but of course this could be any type of formula, anything that I wanted to show him. Then he could come in, he'll see that on his screen. And then what he can do is he can go in here and he could say something like, you know, okay, sounds good. So now you can see he's made a change in there. It takes a few moments initially to synchronize and it, that will depend on the speed of your internet connection and I have found that once I've been sharing for just a few moments, this becomes quite quick. So now we have a dialogue happening where I can make changes, Bender can make changes, and we're affecting this spreadsheet in real time. As I mentioned earlier in the video, if you want to practice this yourself, check out these videos where I show you how you can enable Microsoft Preview in your own systems. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Like, subscribe, and share, and do all those great YouTube things. Thank you for watching.